Hello, uh, my name's Charlie Daish, and I am playing Fred in Owls in the Moss. Come and enjoy a play, a pint, and a pasty. Hi, Charlie. So we hey. met a few years back on Mamma Mia. We what did. is it that draws you to small fringe productions compared to huge global shows like Mamma Mia? Um, the, 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 uh, the immediacy of it, the, um, the audience, and um, uh, th they're only as far away uh, from me as you are, so um, you've got to be good. Um, <laughs> not that you don't have to be good in, in, in other things, but I like the... Um, it's a different and a very unique kind of a buzz that you get from um, working in that kind of a space. Um, you know, plus the fact that it's uh, it's new writing, um, and uh, there's no kind of um, there's no star system in a fringe kind of production, and everybody's on the same. Everybody's working towards the same uh, end, and it, uh, it, it 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 feels as an actor uh, a lot more creative. You have more input, um, uh, or you feel more. Um, I don't know, more valued. I could go on with this for hours if you like, but I mean, yeah. you, 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 you really do. Um, not, not that you don't have anything like that in, 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 in other productions, but with other productions, like say the, you know, the Mamma Mia's and stuff like that, um, it's, it's about the producer, it's, it's, it's about the lighting guy, it's about the musical director, and, and, and it's all that. And so your role it starts to go down a bit, whereas with, with a fringe theatre production, Everybody's kind of got a nice little chunk, mm. you know, um, to, to have a go at from, you know, props to, to you know, making tea, whatever it is that everybody Absolutely. feels. And, that, and that's, um, you know, a very uni unique thing with Fringe. And, I think and, so. And, and, a bit of background about you. Yeah. Um, what, what, what could we have seen you acting in this year? Um, I, I have been, um, I've been doing lots of uh, bits and pieces of telly. Um, I did this great thing um, with um, Harry uh, Shearer where I played a uh, senator, uh, John Connolly, who was um, the guy that was shot in the car when Kennedy was shot in 63. And he was doing a thing called the Nixon tapes, which is basically all the tapes that Nixon made, um, uh, which he had. Um, he was doing, uh, he, he took them down and, and wrote them all down. And we did scenes um, fr from that and I played the, this senator. So it was um, really cool to sort of go down to Merton, which is uh, where we used to shoot the bill, and um, you're, you know, walk into a 1970s Oval Office um, and be American. Um, and uh, no, that was that was really good fun. Um, and what else? Uh, done some uh, some Casualty. Um, I did this this really good show called um, um, And a Mother's Son uh, with Paul McGann and um, I can't remember anyone else. Anyway, um, where I was playing a copper. Um, and my, my first scene uh, was I had to arrest somebody, you know, bloody, bloody, blah, blah, I arrest you, da, 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 anything you have to say, da, 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 da. so I had it all worked out, it's all marvelous. This was my first day's shoot, so I'm bounding in, very, very excited. Off I go, do it, cut, that's really great. And the director comes up to me and he says, Charlie, that was, um, that was really, really, really good, but um, he's, um, well, he's not the bank robber, he's not the train robber, is he? You know, he's just a teenage little punk down there, so maybe we can... Okay, yes, yes. <laughs> calm it down, calm <laughs> it down. I've done this loads and loads of times. You know, I went for... <laughs> Charlie, mate, shh. Sh so, um, but anyway, so uh, so that was good. And um, what else? So you've been busy? Yeah, yeah, it's been a good year. It's been a good year for, um, for telly. Yeah, what yeah, was it? Yeah. When I sent you the script for Owls, um, what is it about the script that drew you to, to wanting to be part of the debut production? Um, the writer's alive. Um, really? <laughs> because most of the plays that I've done, um, they're, they're, they're usually dead. Um, <laughs> and um, I, I kind of liked it. It was, it, was, um, it was a really interesting kind of... Um, it's, it's, I like the way you wrote, you know, um, uh, f f f for people. And it was kind of intriguing, you know. You, you, you started reading and thinking, has this... this been done before, but I just like the way he wrote it and um, uh, what, 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 what they were saying to each other. And I, and I kind of thought this 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 feels like it could be um, it could be quite good. So you know, okay, we're very pleased to have you. Anyway, thought we'll give you a whirl. And finally, what will you be ordering for your pasty and a drink? Oh yeah, pasty. Well, um, or a drink. Well, ale, um, master brew, I think. Nice down there. Yeah. Meat, meat or cheese and onion? Oh, meat. Of course, it has to be meat. Thank you very much.